welcome to the Ohio State Duels 2021 semifinal here. We're going to have a rematch. League foes, Brexville. Brexville is going to be red on the scoreboard. Wadsworth will be green. We're going to start at 106 pounds. State Duels semifinal winner to face St. Edward in the final. Loser will wrestle Kaufman for third and fourth place. Here we go. Matches brought to you by Defense Soap. Defense Soap, defend what you built. And Barbarian Apparel conquered the impossible. I am Zeb Miller. This is Ohio. Wrestling on that number one, 106. Brett Stanley, Brett Stanley, Jackson, Jordan, Rockford. Oh my God. So Jackson Joy taking on Brett Stanley here, 106 pounds. Joy Wadsworth. Stanley Brexler should be a good one. Joy, one of the top ranked 106 pounders, all three divisions in the state of Ohio pound for pound. So, two takedown Joy. Joy, your number two ranked Wadsworth. Grizzly up right now on Stanley 2-0. Stanley, you're 14 ranked. Almost six in Division 1. Ohio. Ethan Pickens of Mason, Dan
controlling the hips. One fell out to take down. Soap, defense, soap, defense with your belt and bar bearing apparel, conquer the impossible. This is your state dual semifinal in Division I Ohio. Number one ranked Division I wrestler, 120 pounds. Looking at Caden Jet, the sophomore. He's in the silver singlet, red ankle band. Sticking on Caden Mellon, the freshman. Jet pushing. Pushing across the knee pick. Down here, as soon as they call it, he controls him. There it is. Six one lead. Going to be six. Check it. Six oh six one now. Jet driver's seat. Front headlock. Jet. Eight zero dual score in favor of Roger. Winners. Dylan Russell, Saint Edward, this evening. Jet with another take down. That's a pick. Jet 
fires a shot. Ooh, nice shot by. Oh, beautiful throw by there. By the Wadsworth Grizzly, Cade Mallon. Mallon's yet. So now it's not a major decision anymore. Now I'm back in this thing. Now I'm doing a nice job here. Casey Wilds reported the fall in 15 seconds. Choice Jet. Jet underneath to start the third. Semi-final match is brought to you by Defense Soap. Defense Soap, defend with your goat and Barbarian Apparel, contra the impossible. Winner will have St. Edward. We both teams have lost to in narrow, close duels. These two, their duel came down to heavyweight. And Wadsworth won that duel, so this is a rematch. The Wadsworth Grizzlies won the earlier matchup. 2-1 lead, permanent. the only takedown, 2-1 lead versus Lovarczyk. So this is the, the 
Division One Ohio State semifinal. Ohio State duels in Division One big schools. The winner will have St. Edward tonight. This duel is at St. Edward. Eagles lost a close one to the Graham Falcons in Division Two. Another shot. Two takedowns. The large that screams out on his back. He dumped him on his head. Like the work that shoulder must have popped out on him. And Brock Herman was going to work, man. Two super explosive takedowns for Brock Herman. And now he hurts the war check. The war check is unable to continue here at 126 pounds. This will be a six point injury default for Herman and Brexville. So the war check, Herman. Check your sixth rank Wadsworth senior versus third rank Brock Herman. Herman just a sophomore for Brexville. You hate to see this. As Lewarchuk is a senior. And we are going to pull him. He is done. Herman wins this. We now have a 9 to 8 duel in favor of Brexville. And we're gonna go into 132 pounds. We're gonna be looking at Christopher Ernest. He is going to be taking on Manny Scordas. So Ernest and Scordas coming out here at 132 pounds. Scordas. Scordos is going to be ranked in 19th. He's a junior. Ernest a sophomore. Scordos a junior. So Scordos is going to be red. Chris Ernest, the sophomore, in green for Wadsworth. Even though Wadsworth is red. Ernest will have shot it. The state semifinal match is brought to you by Defense Soap, Defense Soap, the Ben you built, and Barbarian Apparel Contra the Impossible. Scordos for Brexville, Ernest for Wadsworth. 9 8 duel in favor of the Brexville Bees after a default by Lawarch. Semi winner on to the final versus St. Edward here at St. Edward. So Barbarian Apparel conquered the impossible, one of our partners here. D1 semifinal winner got the Eagles tonight here in the Eagles nest. And now there's a slide by by Ernest. 52 takedown. Wadsworth now going to be up at here at 132 pounds. Scordos underneath, Ernest on top. 132s, 98 goal in favor of Rexler.
come up and out. There is a reversal. Ernest up 4 0.
down and bunch it. Happen here. 
12-12 dual state semifinal. Winning team will have the St. Edward Eagles this afternoon in a championship dual division one. Hacker, the senior versus the freshman, Kale Voinovich. Defense up, defense up, defense up, built and Barbarian Apparel conquering the impossible. Packer with his hand tape. Shakes it real quick there. Slide by, attempt by Hale Winovich. Landon Hacker, the senior, taking on the freshman. Hale Winovich. Winovich front headlock. We see two Winoviches in a row. Hale, a freshman in Oklahoma State on Vic Winovich next. Their dad, Vic, also a state champ at Lake Catholic. Kill one of which takes a shot. Another shot. Landon Hacker's got to pick up his intensity. Go get a takedown. Establish dominance over the freshman. If he does that, it's going to be all odds work. The longer you let Kill hang around, the more problems he has. And he's problems, folks. He can win a state title and do one. 145 this year. His brother did it as a freshman. He can do it. So, Landon Hacker, the senior. Gotta get something going here. One of them shoves him off. We're gonna get a restart here. We're in the first period here. Inside of a minute. Nice hard hands there by Voinovich. Hacker, Voinovich. Front headlock, Voinovich. This is 145 pounds. A little half shot there. Inside of 15 seconds. In the first, scoreless bout. Landon Hacker, Wadsworth. Kill one of its Brexville rematch 12 12 duel Barber. They're in the same league, Suburban Conference. Often the league championship is decided, well, every year the league championship in wrestling is decided amongst these two schools. Hacker, one of its scoreless start of the second period. Hacker covers one of its looking to come out of touch with the boot. Hacker looking to tilt in there. Had a claw. This is the D1 semifinals. One of us up to his feet. Stall, oh, Hacker. Now one of his faces, Hacker, tracks him off. This one for the five minutes is getting zesty, folks. Good day for Stalin. Hacker Wadsworth Sr. One of its caution. Hacker, wow, he got away with one there. One of its underneath catches the foot though. Boot comes in. 
15 here in the second, 3-0 lead, Kale Voinovich. Back in power half by Landon Hacker, Hacker's underneath. And we're going into the third, 3-0 lead. Choice, Hacker, and he is gassed, hurting all of it. And Coach Wenger asked for a timeout. He just got absolutely cranked on. Holy smokes. some chunks here it looks like. He might throw up. And Voinovich was putting it on him, folks. A punishing ride. Holy smokes. Your shoulders are not made to do that. If you didn't know.
zero answers for this. And now, what are we going to do it again to him? Watch it again! Catch and release, 6-3 lead, 8-3. Vic Voinovich heading to Oklahoma State next year. We're going to get a restart 8 3 lead Voinovich. This opponent from Wadsworth, Nick Humphreys. Nick Humphreys, Vic Voinovich, 8 3 going into the second. Just the tappers out there. Point lead. Point of its choice. Point of it, she's going to go underneath. Humphrey's covers. Up and out. Point of it. Point of its left handed head inside. Cuts across. Can't do much with it. Dual score 15 12 match for 93 point of it. <laughs> hard hands, very hard hands. Beautiful snap down 11 to 11 3 now. So, one of it's got to be thinking obviously, tech ball pin, Humphreys. Goes up a spin, go behind off the snap down. And then hard hands, pulling on him, front headlock, spin, go behind, catch and release, point of it. Humphreys, no answers, on the edge, pushing him all over. And there it is, now they're saying, hit it. Point of it, hard hands, hard hands, pull. Snap down, pull, pull, hard hands. Pulling, rinse, repeat. There it is. 
bounces his head off the mat. Literally, that's what it looks like. And looking for the tech fall here. And Humphreys. No answers yet. I don't have any answers for it, so. Off, folks, when you're wrestling a guy at this level. And we're we going to the third choice of the Humphreys. Trying to avoid the tech fall here. It's a 13 point deficit right now. So Humphreys underneath. Looks like one of us is probably going to let him go. He is. Loose. Pulling, 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 front headlock, bouncing, running corner. Now, next move, hard hands, pulling, pull them down underneath, runs corner, drops double, two takedown. Voinovich, I was wrong. Only for one more. Like an assassin almost. Point of it on the edge. Humphreys. Trying not to give up this major decision. Check, check that. The pin or tuck is what he's trying not to give up. Next point. Next takedown. Will be attacked. Go feet to back, I can see it. Mixer, just thinking about it. Maybe try and whip him over with an assassin for the headlock. Not scoring because it will be a tech if he does. He's not taking the takedown because he wants the near fall, the feet to back. So he refuses to take it. Runs him over, headlocks him. What's he looking for? A fall? There it is, Vic Voinovich! He was looking for it, wouldn't take the takedown. And great job, great play by Humphrey. And that is a, one of the weirdest situations I've ever seen where a guy has a clear takedown, won't take it. So he wanted to go to the back, got it, and then did it and finish it. That was great. So there it is, he does get the technical fall. Five more teams. So the lead now is. Geez, repeat, what is the lead? Plus 15, 12, 20, 12 now. 20, 12 heading into 160. So we're going to be looking at Sam Nafar. Looks like Logan Scanlon. Ba for Frexville, he'll be in the red. Ba is going to be taken on Logan Scanlon. Scanlon for Wadsworth in the green ankle band, red and black singlet. Ba, Scanlon in on a shot. Ba tries to pass his foot. For Wadsworth, looking to get him back in this duel, they're in the duel. It's 20 12. So Scanlon here, 160 pounds, dual score 20 to 12. This is the Division I state semifinal. Here in Division I Ohio, we're at Lakewood St. Edward High School. The Eagles are already in the finals awaiting the winner of this duel. Right now, it probably looks like it's going to be Rexville. They're up 20 to 12. As I say that, Nafa comes out for Rexville. And Scanlon stabs him up in a cradle, but now we're 2-1. If 
Claws up to his feet. These duels brought to you by Defense Up, Defense Up, Defense with your belt and Barbarian Apparel. Conquer the impossible. Watch the Barbarian Hour. With my co host Jared Alford, sometimes Hannah Mears. Check it out. Nice shot. Scanlon, right hand, head inside single leg. Nefatra to jump off. Scanlon. Let's see where this goes. Rexville's got a really good. There's a takedown from the Fox. For three, two lead for Sam the Fox. Correction, this is Carter Lloyd, right? This is Carter Lloyd, I just checked with Big Vic Winovich. Carter Lloyd out there for Brexville, not Sam. I say that, Sam gets tilted up for one count, but no near falls here in the semifinals of the Division I state championships or duels in the state of Ohio here at St. Edward. So Carter Lloyd is out there. Lloyd for Brexville. Keep working. Logan Scanlon. Scanlon on top right now. Down 3 2 to Brexville. Carter Lloyd, the senior. Lead to four to two. D1 semifinals here in Ohio. State duels. Winning team between Brexville and Wadsworth will face the St. Edward Eagles tonight here in St. Edward's home gym. And Scanlon down four to Scanlon. As I say that, six two now. For Carter Lloyd. Carter Lloyd has a 6 2 lead on Logan Scanlon, the senior. It is 20 to 12 in favor of Brexville. Back to back wins by the Voinovichs at 45 and 52. Lloyd feeds him a nice forearm there. out there, he doesn't get it. Grabbing his calf. Lloyd gonna go talk to the Brexville coaches. Scanlon. End of the second here, short time. Hey, so neutral.
Maxwell to start the third. And Lloyd looking to run the lead of Rexville's up from 20 to 12. This would all oh, do it. Oh, nice job by Lloyd. He cross ankle picks him. Now they're in a scramble. Now he front quarter Nelson's him. That was nice. Lloyd looking to go behind. Two, eight to two. For Lloyd. This guy listed as a 60 pounder. They had him listed as a 52. Carter Lloyd is senior. This is what depth will do for your program, folks. Todd Haverdell has done it. He hasn't figured it out. We're neutral. If you're Carter Lloyd, you got to be making a major decision. We've got 10 4 lead. Nice shot. Inside for Scanlon. He gets front quarter Nelson to his hip. Now he needs to get an escape to not give up the major. Wadsworth bench yelling, we need one. Carter and Lloyd folks doing the job still. We get one though. Lloyd got to get another takedown. He ankle picks him. Two takedown. Carter Lloyd keeps wrestling. Holy smokes. Single leg. And Lloyd gonna pick up a major decision. It's gonna be 24 to 12 after 160. They're gonna have to win out almost. They need bonus too. So 14-5 major decision for Logan Lloyd. Called him by the wrong name for the first period, but he got the job done. Going to the 170. We're gonna Media gonna take on Logan Messer here at 170 pounds. This is gonna be smaller of the two Vanadia twins. There are three Vanadia brothers in the lineup here in Brexville. We've got Max Vanadia at 95 and Ben Vanadia at 220, the number one 220 in the state of Ohio. So this is Luke Vanadia. Nice shot, left hand headed inside, single leg here for Wadsworth, Logan Messer. Oh, nice job by Messer, two take on Messer. Two O lead Messer on Vanadia right now. Ohio State Duels semifinal winner onto the finals versus St. Edward tonight here in this very gym. Eagles knocked off both of these teams already earlier in the year in duels. So, Messer looking to get near fall. He's got at least two, but he's gonna need some. He's gonna need a fall over Venadia here. And Messer's looking like what Messer should look like. Messer, your number two ranked, 170 in the state. Got to see number one. Super impressed with LaSalle's Dylan Walker. He's really good. Dylan Walker is like a PA guy. He reminds me of a PA guy. Tim Messer, two of the top guys in D1, 170 pounds. Messer's getting the job done right now.
220 in the state. They got Rizzo next. He wrestles a crazy style for Braxville. I mean, we'll see. I mean, it is going to be wild. John List for the two rank 195. It's going to be a war up and down. The stall underneath on Vanadia. Go get one. 
Takes a shot, but maybe a counter shot. Messer trying to sit the corner. Got to step over his back foot. And Nadia is not going to let him get this. And it will be a regular decision by Logan Messer. Makes it 28 Rizzo. Rizzo Jackson coming out here. Rizzo is a wild one, folks. Watch them, the crazy things this guy's gonna do. He is taking on Jazz Jackson at 182, the senior. Both of these guys. Seniors. Rizzo, senior, Jackson, a senior. Brexville wins this one. It is all but over, folks. Final for the State Ohio Duels Division One. Jackson Rizzo. Jackson takes a shot. Rizzo counter. Scoreless first here. Minute in. Jackson, Wadsworth, Rizzo, Brexville, 28-15 duel. They got the number one 220 in the state in Ben Venadia, heading to Purdue. Bexville's got guys. Matt is brought to you by defensive, 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 Might have to tape that guy up. So 24-15. Jess Jackson just blew his shoe out. Here, 182 pounds. 24-15. Wadsworth has to win this match. Because you gotta figure 220. Colin Grimm from Maverick Blackburn. Probably doesn't have a great chance against number one rank in India. So Rizzo, Jazz Jackson, 2-1 lead. 
Anthony Rizzo. Jackson did get an escape, but blew his shoe out in the process. 24-15. Fake there by Jackson. Jackson got to go get a takedown here to give his team a chance going into 195. Number two rank is John List. You got to figure. We have second Vanadia. Second Vanadia in the lineup will be looks like Max Vanadia, one of the twins. They are sophomores. So Max and Luke Vanadia are twins. Rizzo takes a shot. Counter. Two takedown on the edge. Wow. Jackson takes the lead, 3-2 here, 182. Blew his shoe out on an escape, now he's got a 3-2 lead here at 182. So for Wadsworth to have any hope, any hope. Oh, he catches him in a Peterson, but then he crucifixes him. Reversal, gonna make it 4-3. So 4 3 back and forth match here at 182. Rizzo, Braxville, Jackson, Wads were short time here. And here comes the tapper, and we're going to go to the third 4 3. Rizzo, Choice Rizzo. win by Rizzo probably slams the door shut. Maybe not mathematically, but you got Ben Benadia coming at 220 against a freshman or a 195 backup. So Jackson's going to let him go. It's going to be a 5-3 bout here. Start of the third period here at 182 pounds. 24-15 duel. Brexville in the lead. Brexville with a match lead as well with Anthony Rizzo here at 182. Anthony Rizzo wrestles a crazy style. Puts a ton of points on the board. A lot of crazy stuff happens. I think I had a 16-14 match. He lost to Perrine earlier this year. It was 17-14. That's what it was. Shot. Jackson's got him dead to right. They rolled her off the mat. No score. So Rizzo still has a 5-3 lead on Jackson. Jackson's got to go get one here. Jackson absolutely needs a take now. Jazz Jackson, Wadsworth won this in the duel, won this last duel, in which Wadsworth won the last duel. Jazz Jackson off the mat. We're going to get a restart. Third period here inside a minute 30 seconds. Jackson, gotta go get a takedown. Down 5-3. Inside of a minute. Takedown ties it up. He's gotta go take down right out. 5-3. Duel 5-3 bout Rizzo with the lead. And a poke. Totally incidental. Incidental is it Jackson. Jackson gets that. And now Jackson faking, moving, taking ground. Rizzo reacting. He takes another shot. Jackson's super frustrated here. Rizzo just got to wait for him at this point. Stand, stand and wait. Doesn't really need to do much, has a stall to do. Rizzo doing what Rizzo should be doing. 
Circling in, staying in the stage, look at the board. And now Rizzo turns the results. And Rizzo picks up the win. That's going to make it 27 15 going into 195. List Vanadia. So List Vanadia going into 195. 27 15. This is the other Vanadia brother, the twin. So this duel is probably over. We have two Vanadias in a row. This is the sophomore twin, Max Vanadia. His brother Luke lost. I'm not sure. And then we'll see Ben Venadia, the senior. So Max, a sophomore, Luke's, Luke is a sophomore, they're twins. And Ben, a senior, third in the state. Up to 220. Headed to Purdue, Purdue next year. Ben next at 220. So having Ben Venadia next is probably the key for breakfast. Well, I mean, it's a team win, but with what's left. You gotta say Ben Venadia is probably not losing to Brexville. Or to, sorry, he's not losing for Brexville to Watt. He has a freshman or a backup at 195, so. List, who's ranked number two in the state of Ohio, took a loss today against Mason. He lost to the guy ranked right behind him. Bryce Pearson. No, I'm sorry, Owen Andrews. Amberdeen knocked him off by apology. Owen Amberdeen knocked off the list earlier on. Uh, front quarter of Nelson for list as it goes behind. And it is 27 15. Gotta get a pin here. Anything less than a pin from list ends the duel mathematically as soon as Benjamin steps on the mat. And Probably smashes whoever Wadsworth has. There is a claw tilt. Nope, did not get it. Wadsworth saying you swipe two. So you're not happy about it. List two O leads into the second. List is not looking at it. So the next match is at 4.30. As soon as this goes over, there'll probably be about a 15 minute break. We will go right into the finals in third and fourth place bouts. Finals will, it looks like, apparently feature Brexville. Don't really want to jinx them, but that looks like what's going to happen. So, Venadia got list hopping now. He's gonna ding him again. He's gotta just let go of the leg. Oh no, they got him. They bail him out with us. <laughs> Stalemate there. Oh no, he doesn't have to call that stalling. I'm okay with that. List, three O lead list. John List, Wadsworth, senior rank number two in the state. I'm guessing after the loss to Amberdeen, he will drop to three now. Nice double leg, but rolls, falls, his hips go way away from him. Amberdeen is a big, tall, lean dude. And these are the two guys, Amberdeen and List, are the other guys that are trying to knock off Seth Schumann. Ohio is tough, folks. It is deep and it is tough, especially in Division I Ohio. It's much deeper, much tougher than the other two divisions. And it's not even close. The depth is crazy. So, list real lead here on Vanadia. Max Vanadia, 195, overtime, shut, go behind. 
Beautiful overtight stuff go behind. And looking for a tilt now is Liss. They did count two, count two there. He's gonna get full allotment of swipes with Liss. He is going to have an 8 0 lead going into the third. And the Panadias are massive humans. They're big dudes. Panadia probably should have just got a caution here. Didn't. This is Luke Panadia. Or not Chuck, this is Max Panadia. See Ben Max. We saw Luke early. There's a shot, lift, underhook, to take on ten of these. List, showing why he's the number two ranked guy in the state. Soon to be number three. Nice job, one on one on the right side. Roger, by defense, up, defense, up, defense, but you're building barbarian apparel kind of impossible. There goes the tilt again for List. He could pin him. He gives him these two near fall there, and they show two. So List is really picking Vanity apart now. One on one, deep waist tilt. Counted at least two. No, only counted one. Again, now he's gonna claw one on one. He's gonna hold him for the whole set of near falls here, and Vanadia is not gonna be able to get away. And that is going to be a technical fall. Man, he just piled the points up quick, fast, and in a hurry. So there it is. John Lesk gets a tight ball. Vanadia and by the score, 15 nothing. 15 nothing really good. And Vanadia heading to Purdue next year. He was taking on the Wadsworth Grizzly. Let's see what Wadsworth sent out. Your number one ranked 220 in the state of Ohio. Vanadia can move. He is the third Vanadia in the lineup today. Vanadia takes a shot. Nice job by Vanadia. Other two Vanadia is twin. Well, he's not his twins, but they are twins. Lost their matches at 70 and 95. And List made this a 27 20 dual meet. It's not going to matter after this. Cohen Grimm out. Cohen Grimm for Wadsworth. This is the 220 bout. Grimm Vanadia. Vanadia double leg off the two on one. It's Grimm to his back. This will ice the match. Vanadia can get the fall here. Wadsworth's going to the finals. It's mathematically over with this win. It is 27 to 20 right now. Vanadia will put Brexville into the state finals against St. Edward here at 220. Looking for a fall in revenge against Wadsworth. It's Vanadia and Brexville. Three near fall. Vanadia 7-1 lead. 30 seconds remains. First period. It's only inevitable, folks. Vanadia and Brexville up 27-20 right now. Bosworth has to pick up a win here. One way or another a win. The Blair right on the left side here. Wrist out. And Vanadia flattens out. 7-1 lead here going into the second. Vanadia up big. Grim's choice. This is the state semifinal. These are the 220 pounders. State duels, Division I Ohio. We're neutral. 7 2 now, Vanadia. Ben Vanadia. Gonna be a boiler maker. Looks like a good size 97 right now. Two takedown, Vanadia. Looking for the down arm, catches it. Vanadia looking to 
Footer's team in the state final right now. It's close right now. He's looking for the fall. Win here for Venadia. Does the job. I believe it's 12 to 2 now. Venadia looking to put that arm out on the back. Grim trying to fight him. And he's being a workman like in his performance here. He's been Venadia. There's the stall warning underneath on Wadsworth. Obviously, thinking pin all the way. Let's him go. Ten point lead. Then Venadia, the senior from Brexville. Snaps him down, drops down. Single, head outside, has the foot. Barnyard roll there, chest wrap. Take down Venadia. Showing you why he's the number one 220 in the state of Ohio in Division I. In the, the big division, big schools, highest enrollment. And it looks like Brexville's a period away. Or a couple points away from a berth in the state final here against St. Edward this evening. Here at St. Edward. I believe it's a 4.30 start. It's a little before 4 o'clock now. So it looks like Brexville will probably get a little break. Not unless the hoop falls on Vanadia above his head right now. It's on the, in the rafters or, I don't know, lightning strike. I don't know. And there is it's an escape. Looks like he's going to have to go feet to back. Nice hard pull by Vanadia. Hard hands by Venadia. Grim, two on one. Shot Venadia, low double. Looking for near fall here. Getting it. Looking for the fall. Ben Venadia looking to put his team in the state finals here. He's going to one way or another. Looked like he had it. There it is. Ben goes to the state finals. Venadia helps. And that is it. Brexville to the finals here this afternoon. At 285, first obstacle, Brexville and Reese Watford. So here we go. The 285s are on the net. It's not going to matter. They're doing it for pride. And Brexville's already won this duel. 32, 20. Braxville, you lost this match last time. Let's see if you can get one back. They're throwing them. They're throwing some haymakers. Oh, they're getting after it. And now headlock. Ooh, big throw! Looking for a fall off the headlock, and there it was. Rexville's going to the finals. The final game score, Rexville, 33, Wadsworth, 26. 33-26, B! Rexville will now advance to the finals to Rexville, St. Edward. Wadsworth will advance to the second. The consolation sunrise to Russell, or final rider to Russell's offer.